news. According to investigators, a personal gun belonging to an Oklahoma County deputy is linked to two road rage incidents. Our Sylvia Corkill learns the deputy's girlfriend is now charged with one of the crimes. Sylvia? Amanda, according to court filings, Bridget Ty Tyler shot into a woman's vehicle in June of last year. Charges only recently filed after a second incident involving a the same gun was brought to their attention. Earlier this month, OKC police arrested 29-year-old Bridget Tyler. I was just more so relieved that that day, and they finally did catch her. So. According to court filings, in June 2022, OKC police were called to investigate a road rage incident near Northeast 13th and Walnut. There, a woman who does not want to be identified told police an unknown driver shot at her twice. The bullet could have easily like went towards my side of the car, or it could have hit the windshield, and I could have crashed into something. An affidavit says the victim showed officers where a bullet hit her car. And nine months later, on March 5th, Midwest City police responded near I-40 in Southeast 29th to investigate another road rage incident. According to court filings, a victim reported she was being followed by a subject who was pointing a gun at her. Court records show police confronted the suspect Bridget Tyler on that scene. She was ticketed and released. But after officers also seized her gun, filings show Tyler's boyfriend and Oklahoma County Sheriff's deputy contacted police and told them the gun they recovered was his. According to an affidavit, a ballistics test later connected the deputy's personal gun to a shell casing recovered from the 2022 road rage shooting in OKC. Playing with somebody for I can play with a gun, that's not acceptable. You're just putting everybody in a very dangerous predicament.